Shalom, friends. With this week, we begin a new book of the Torah. We begin the book Bamidbar, the book known in English as Numbers, the fourth book of the Torah. And having taken the children of Israel out of Egypt and now wandering in the wilderness, we begin a census, a counting of the names of each person and counted by their family, by their clan, by their tribe. So it's a way of assessing the entire tribe. But the Torah, of course, always aims for something deeper, something more significant than just what's on the surface because meaning bubbles up from within. And, and I wanna pay attention to some of the Hebrew here because it's really remarkable. The Torah tells us after establishing the time that God is speaking to Moses in the second year, it says, Se'u et rosh kol adat b'nei Yisrael. Now, that has the flavor of, I want you to count each head of the children of Israel. But se'u literally means to lift up. So this isn't accounting for the sake of flattening down. This isn't counting for the sake of crushing somebody. This is counting for the sake of lifting them up, of elevating them, of helping them to attain their best potential, right? There's something about noticing distinctiveness, noticing individuality that the Torah is telling us contributes to human thriving, that each of us have a gift to bring to the larger whole. And when we're not counted, when any of us are not counted, somehow that diminishes all of us and it diminishes our group as an entity. So at the very beginning of this book, before it moves on to any other topic of thought or community or structure or morality, it establishes when you count somebody, you lift them up. And you lift them up in their family, you lift them up in their clan, you lift them up in their tribe. So what if we take that seriously? What if we realize as a society today that we also need to make everybody count, not just for what they add to the total, but for what each distinctive and unique individual brings to the mix. Everybody has a say, everybody has a voice, everyone has something to contribute, and we are as a group made stronger and more vibrant by the diversity of individuals who frame our communities and our families. Let's take that with us into this week, shall we? Everyone counts. Each individual in all of the beauty of their distinctiveness augments the totality and makes us all of us better. Shalom.